footfall is a condition that can affect both men and women. While it most commonly begins in midlife, there are steps we can take to prevent and treat it. Hair loss is a condition that can be influenced by hormonal factors, genetics, and especially scalp health. In this episode, I'm going to be sharing my top tips on building an ideal hair and scalp care routine that focuses on strengthening and anchoring your roots for healthy hair inside out. This masterclass is sponsored by Clear Hair Care, a leader in hair and scalp cosmeceuticals. Clear Scalpceuticals Hair Fall Resist for Women and the Clear Men Scalp Pro Anti-Hair Fall Fortifying Ranges are ideally formulated for specific hair and scalp concerns pertaining to men and women. Backed by robust research and scientific evidence, the Clear Catalyst range features key actives such as denoxidil and folilock, which are clinically proven to improve scalp health and reduce hair fall. We begin with the basics of hair signs. The scalp and hair shaft must be clearly distinguished. Where your roots reside within the scalp itself is a complex, interconnected ecosystem comprising the scalp microbiome, sebaceous glands which regulate oil production, hormonal receptors, sweat glands, and also the precious hair follicle. Cells regenerate from within the hair follicle, giving rise to new hair growth in a state of balance we call the hair cycle. Well, we may take it for granted that we have hair on our heads. It helps to understand the physiological processes involved. The two main phases of hair can be thought of as the following. The growth phase known as anagen and the falling out phase we call telogen. You may even have heard of telogen effluvium, a fairly common type of hair loss attributed to stress states post-pregnancy or viral illnesses. Luckily, this type of hair fall is self-resolving. The scalp is able to reset itself after the stressor is removed. What we are more concerned with in this masterclass is a type of hair fall we call pattern hair loss. Specifically, male and female pattern hair loss, which is the commonest cause of hair loss worldwide. There are some similarities between the two. They belong to an umbrella term dermatologist named androgenetic alopecia, one which is influenced by hormones. Known as AGA for short, it is distinct from other types of hair fall in that hair follicles undergo what we call miniaturization, a phenomenon which causes hair follicles to shrink, for instance, become miniature in appearance over time. Both relate to the hormone testosterone's effect on scalp receptors, a type of behavior that's determined by one's genetics. This means that if you have a family member with AGA, there is a higher chance that you will also develop it. We will now focus on the distinct characteristics of each. For male pattern hair loss, we regard that as being characterized by vertex thinning and frontotemporal recession, which refers to the reduced density of hair on the top of one's scalp, together with a receding hairline. You might have wondered before, for instance, why some individuals have rather shiny scalps. The reason is that hair miniaturization actually causes hair follicles to shrink. As a result, instead of the rough, bumpy surface scalp hair typically possesses, it becomes smooth and shiny. Hair fall in men is graded according to the Hamilton Norwood scale, one which also measures the extent of hairline recession, reflecting severity. Female pattern hair loss, on the other hand, most commonly starts at the top of the head as opposed to right at the hairline. The underlying physiological processes are the same in both genders. Now that we've established the signs of why AGA occurs, we will move on to how best we can utilize this knowledge to prevent and treat hair fall in both men and women. 
The purpose of a scalp care routine is to cleanse off excess sebum, nourish the barrier, and stimulate hair growth. Hair care is often regarded as a separate routine, especially for women who keep long hair, as hair care regimens must be designed to treat the hair shaft rather than the scalp alone. Soft, shiny, and smooth hair is a reflection of hair health. And that can be achieved with the use of correct products in an ideal hair care regimen. I'll be teaching you exactly how you can achieve this with a minimalist routine. In this practical how to guide, we will go through what a three step dermatologist recommended hair and scalp care routine looks like, and I'll also elaborate on the function of each step. I'll be sharing important tips on application, frequency, and also tying it all to the hair science you have just learned. A simple three-step scalp and hair care routine looks something like this. Step one, shampoo. Shampoos are, in my opinion, the number one important step in any hair care routine. The reason is because hair roots are, first of all, anchored to the scalp. And a healthy scalp is one that is cleansed and nourished. As the scalp is considered a hair-bearing area of skin, it is not well suited to leave on products which can cause a sticky residue. A cleansed scalp is also one that absorbs actives well. So before we consider hair and scalp serums, it's imperative to choose a shampoo that fulfills these functions. Medicated shampoos that contain pyroctin olamin, for instance, an effective anti-dandruff ingredient can be particularly beneficial for those with hair loss, as excess oil in the scalp can lead to another type of scalp condition known as seborrheic dermatitis or oily dandruff. Actives can also help stimulate hair follicle activity and regrowth, promoting thicker, fuller hair. For instance, dinoxidil, a root-strengthening zinc salt combined with antioxidant yeast peptide, has been proven to reduce hair fall by over 2,800 strands in a single month. In studies performed in women and men, results indicate a reduction of over 6,000 strands in a single month. There is a right way to apply medicated shampoos in order for you to experience the maximum benefits. Double cleanse if your scalp is greasy. This means a first wash followed by a second, which involves leaving on the lather for about two to three minutes, depending on the manufacturer's instructions, if any. The latter is especially important when it comes to medicated shampoos. Actives can penetrate better when left on the scalp for a longer period of time. Step two has to do with hair conditioning. For those with long hair, hair conditioning is an essential step for detangling and improving hair manageability. On this note, there is a correct way to use hair conditioner, which you might be surprised many don't know. First of all, the right conditioner would mean you wouldn't need to use very much of it at all. The most effectively formulated hair conditioners can detangle hair in as little as a dollop for shoulder length hair. The key here is to use a wide tooth detangling comb in the shower to distribute the conditioner evenly. Wet hair is more fragile, but also easier to detangle. I would recommend avoiding closed tooth combs or brushes on wet hair. Go for white tooth detangling combs instead. Step 3. Use a hair serum. Serums can be categorized into those applied to the scalp for root strengthening and stimulating hair regrowth, as well as leave-on serums, which are usually oil-based and intended for application on the hair shaft. Clear's Scalp Cuticles Hair Care and Scalp Care Range is a meticulously formulated regimen backed by the latest in scientific research. Lifestyles may differ between individuals, rendering the choice of a cleansing shampoo critical in one's scalp care routine. Those with long hair may have concerns such as tangles, brittle and damaged hair, especially in the instance of chemical or heat-related damage.
The half-fall resist range for women is ideally designed to tackle these concerns from the root with shampoo and serum actives, anchoring the roots and restoring a state of scalp health, and a nourishing hair conditioner that builds hair shaft resilience. The men's Scalp Pro Anti Hair Fall Fortifying Range is an efficient and targeted fuss-free approach to men's hair and scalp care. Dermatologists recommend it for holistic scalp and hair health, beginning from the inside out.